Am I the arsehole? For kicking my 72-year-old mill out of the house at night, because she threw away my things? Then insists that her way is more logical. She only really comes for holidays, though, and I do like her a lot. So I don't mind putting up with these mild annoyances. I'm currently pregnant with our little girl, who will be born in a few months. This is a miracle I really didn't think it would happen, especially so late, but we got lucky. When my mill heard, she was super excited and said she would come over to help us get ready for the baby. She offered to stay for the next six months or so to help out, because my husband and I both work long hours and it will be hard to handle the baby. On top of this, she is also pretty emotionally invested in this, because she truly sees herself as part of our family. She arrived a few days ago and set herself up, then she started with the cleaning. I like collecting things from garage sales and such. Things like little sculptures and books and baskets, stuff a lot of people would consider utter junk. Our house is definitely overstuffed, but it's reasonably tidy and doesn't seem like a hoarder's house or anything. My mill, on the other hand, likes everything surgically clean. Yesterday I came home from work to find the house like a war zone, she went through my cabinets and cleared out everything she considered junk, and had apparently made several trips to Goodwill before I got home. I was really angry and I asked her why she would ever do this. She said the house has to be tidy for the baby, and that it would be dangerous for the baby to be in my cluttered house. Then she took the next huge bag of stuff and tried to walk out the door. I kind of lost it, and I told her she could get out right now. She was shocked that I was serious, and she said she doesn't have anywhere to go and it's so late. It was about 9.30. I booked her a hotel room and called a taxi. My husband came home an hour later, and when I told him what happened, he was furious with me. He says I disrespected his mom and was ungrateful for everything she's trying to do for us. Am I the asshole? He says I disrespected his mom and was ungrateful for everything she's trying to do for us. And throwing your stuff away wasn't disrespectful? She's not helping if she's creating stress. That's really the opposite of helpful. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. WTF, grimacing face, you have a husband problem and you probably need to ask him if he gave her the green flag to tidy up. My mom is sort of the same way, though her house can be however she likes it, and threw out some stuff I wasn't ready to get rid of, well that's a boundary she won't cross again. You need to talk to your husband and then mill but I suspect the husband has some explaining to do. Cause this is wild. Not the asshole. But as ever you don't really have a mill problem as a partner problem. If someone comes in and disrespects your home and literally throws your stuff away he should have your back. I think you were wildly optimistic with her staying to help when you already know she's over controlling and takes over in your own home. Mark my words draw those boundaries before the baby arrives. As I'm sure she'll have strong opinions on what to do there. Not the asshole but who in their right mind invites their mom mill to stay at their house six months before the baby is due. That's insane, sorry. And with what she previously did, her taking over was to be expected. Not her throwing stuff away, that's also insane. Not the asshole. As much as I appreciate an uncluttered home, you don't throw away someone else's belongings. Send husband to hotel along with his mother for the lack of support. Not the asshole. WTF. Seriously WTF, who thinks it's in any way acceptable to throw out someone else's stuff like that. Not the asshole. Your husband needs to learn that his mum can't steal your property and throw them away. How would your husband feel if you packed up his stuff and gave it all to charity? Show him this post. Tell him you will make a list of boundaries that she will not be allowed to cross if he wants to have her visit again. Especially with the baby. Make sure your husband agrees because if he doesn't then there's gonna be big problems. Let her know the boundaries and if she crosses them she will be asked to leave. Not the asshole. She may think your house has too much clutter, and it possibly may. 
but she has no right to get rid of anything without yours and your partner's say. Not the asshole. And congrats, you do have a horror story with your mill just like everyone else on this sub. Your husband is a bigger problem here, though. He's got to back you up and be willing to set boundaries with his mother. This is a hill you should be willing for your relationship to die on, because once the baby is born it's going to only get worse. Congrats on the kid, op. Not the asshole your mill is a horror show. You didn't disrespect her at all. She disrespected you. This may not work out well because your husband is a fool who is invested in the abusive mill. Not the asshole. It's not her house and she sounds very inconsiderate at the least. Nata. What she was doing was not helping you in any way. She was throwing your stuff out without asking so you threw her out. Not the asshole she treats your home as her home. Rearranging your kitchen cupboards is a power move. You and your husband need to get on the same page about boundaries now. Before she starts treating your baby as her baby. Clutter disgusts me and I just couldn't live in it, especially with baby stuff piled on top, but there's no way I'd ever clean out someone's house without permission. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. You have a husband problem though since he didn't back you up when you kicked a robber out of your home. And I've never heard of anyone treating a thief as kindly as to rent them a hotel room and a taxi before so how much more nicely did the hubs expect you to treat his criminal mother? Not the asshole. You really need to establish some firm boundaries. Contact the goodwill and see if you can get the stuff back. Natar, don't let your mill stay for six months. She's supposed to be here to help out and lower stress for the expecting mother, not throw her shit out and micromanage. She is doing the opposite of helping. You got her a hotel room and a taxi, now it's time to tell your husband she ain't staying and get him to back you up on this W the convo with his mother. Not the asshole. Your mill and your husband are though. She is for what she did, you don't go through other people's stuff and throw out their belongings. Your husband is an arfa siding with his mother, you should have thrown him out as well. Not the asshole, this is utter disrespect from her and I would make her compensate or try to bring back everything she got rid of. If the hubby is unhappy, he can stay at the hotel as well. Do not let her return. Edit to add, I might actually file a police report, tell your husband that so he understands you are not kidding. Not the asshole. You have a jmal and you need to get your husband on the same page as you because this is only going to get worse, not better, when your baby gets here. She will take over there too. The baby isn't going to spontaneously start walking around and start picking up anything. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Your house. Your rules. Harsh, yes, but you didn't just toss her out with no resources. You booked a room for her. How she chose to handle it crossed every line. When she comes back, make it clear that this is your home. I'd also have some words with my husband too. Plus, I'm sure your child wouldn't be the first to have a parent that likes to collect things. Just make sure it's safe for the child.